ready whenever you are. Okay, how bad is my makeup? It's not bad. Uh, is it on my nose? Yeah. It's like, <laughs> it's like, my makeup's like smooth. I was about to say, I think face. I got a little bit of her makeup. <laughs> I've been to your cocoon party. Let me take it out of my Okay. The top of your cord says. <laughs> I can't wait to be your wifey for lifey. Thank you, baby. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can do this. Okay. Oh, wow, that's a lot of words. <laughs> <laughs> it took me two hours. Yeah, I'm excited. Oh, no, more makeup. <laughs> I was about to say, I got oh, more makeup. It. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, we're just, you might want to wipe it though. <laughs> Oh God. I love you. You're so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I love you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just really excited. I know. <laughs> I love you. Love you too. Gosh, you look beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, baby. You look Man. Like spiffy. Thank you. I dressed myself. <laughs> oh, I'm so oh no, I think I messed up your makeup. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. That's <laughs> oh, why I man. Gosh, you're so pretty. My dear brothers and sisters in Christ, in a few moments, we will witness the exchange of love between Taylor and Todd. The love that they're about to declare before us all is no simple, ordinary love. In fact, is the most special kind of love, the most sacred type of love, the most powerful love of all, unconditional love. True unconditional love is and must always be a free and total gift. And that's why all of us are here this evening, Taylor and Todd, to celebrate your gift of unconditional love to one another. Okay. Todd, there are no words that I could ever say to fully describe my love to you. I used to always pray that I would find my other half, my person, the one who compliments my strengths and weaknesses. Oh gosh. Stop. Okay, I'm good, I'm good. Before I thought that soulmates was just a cliche, but you're the missing part that I've always needed. From being 18 years old in high school to now, going through college together, I've loved every second of being able to grow with you. Here we are, seven years later, getting ready to say I do. You have the most beautiful soul and the kindest heart, and I'm so blessed to get to experience your love every day. You're my best friend, my rock, and my constant. I love you with my whole heart. Every day I fall more and more in love with you. I have a lot less words on mine. <laughs> so Taylor. I've known from the day that we met that I've loved you. And each day spent together since then has reaffirmed the absolute love that I have for you. I love all the little things that make you who you are, like the way you light up a room just through your presence, or how your warm smile melts away all that burdens me after a long day. I'll always be there for you on your strong coffee mornings, <laughs> your long days, your 11 p.m. nights, and every second in between. I love you wholly, unconditionally, and without end in all that you are and all that you do. Forever yours. With your free gift of unconditional love, what you're really declaring to one another is this. 
I want to share with you whatever I have that is good and beautiful. You did not prove worthy of this gift. It's not a question of deserving my love or earning my love. I have no illusions or delusions that either of us is the best person in the world. The point is that I have freely chosen you. I have decided to give you my gift of unconditional love, and you have freely chosen to give me your gift of unconditional love. Fantastic. <laughs> I love you, Dana. <laughs> I love you. Great. Thank you. Zab, I can't cry. <laughs> May Almighty God bless all of you who are gathered here, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please turn. It is my privilege to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Stephen Todd Kojis, Jr. Then 